how do we ascertain profits and losses through incomplete records now students in this case the first information that we require is opening capital that is capital in the beginning of the year this capital can be calculated by by preparing opening statement of affairs opening statement of affairs now students coming to this point what is statement of affairs statement of affairs is a statement which shows assets and liabilities of a business as on a particular date it is just like the balance sheet in double entry system it is referred to as balance sheet but here it is referred to as statement of affairs it is not exactly projecting your figures these figures are estimated figures so these figures are then collected together in the form of a balance sheet to get to your opening capital then the second step these are steps here the second step is calculate closing capital now closing capital it can be calculated by preparing closing statement of affairs that is statement of affairs at the end of the year at the end of the year means that is on the later date this statement will show the closing figures and lastly we can prepare prepare a statement of profit and loss a statement of profit and loss now students these are three steps to be followed first of all we calculate opening capital then we calculate closing capital and lastly we prepare statements of profits and loss there is some additional information that is required that is info required information required apart from all these is drawings and additional capital introduced during the year that is we require the drawings made by the owner during the year and any additional capital that he might have introduced during the year